You're just in time. TK's teaching us about the moon. Even though you can't see the sun at night, the moon glows because of the sun's rays. But during a lunar eclipse... Uh, ahem? Yes, Emma? Lunar eclipse? I thought we were learning about the moon. We are. Lunar is another word for moon. During a lunar eclipse, the sun moves all the way behind the Earth, blocking the sun's rays completely. That's why an eclipse moon looks so dark. Ooh! <laughs> like this dark? <gasps> ah! Orbit! Turn the lights back on! Oh. I can't! I can't find the switch! It's too dark in here! where we can see a lunar eclipse. Oh, I've always wanted to see the dark side of the moon. Let's see where you can go. The cheese planet? The moon kind of looks like a giant piece of cheese, but it's less stinky. Ooh. The astronomy planet? That's a good place to watch a lunar eclipse from far away, but we want to see one up close. That's not a planet. That's the robot moon. We can't get any closer than that. Yay! <laughs> yes, the robot moon. Excellent choice. Get ready for countdown. Hurry, everyone. Get to your stations and buckle your seatbelts. robot mood would be this bright. Oh, it's like a giant night light in the sky. This isn't so bad. It's not dark at all. Good point, Emma. We came here to see a lunar eclipse. How do we make it do that? Hmm. I think I know. Uh -huh. Check this out. These buttons must control the robot mood. Ooh. Can I try yeah. that? Hmm. Oh. Oh. Hmm. Hmm. Aha! Oh! <laughs> oh! Hmm. Uh. Hmm. Hmm. Uh. Hey! Hmm. Nothing happened! Uh. <gasps> uh huh? <laughs> oh! <laughs> mm? Whoa! Whoa! Orbit! <gasps> something did happen! There's 
there's no gravity! Gravity? Gravity is what holds us to the ground. Or, if there's no gravity, like on the moon, you can... <laughs> Float around! <laughs> Orbit must have hit the no gravity button! Remember, this is the robot moon. We can make it do anything! <laughs> That was so much fun! Much better than playing in the dark. Let's see what else the robot moon can do. Oh! Cows oh. <laughs> oh. jumping over the moon! Oh, this is awesome! Hmm. Ooh. Huh? That's funny. I think one of the stars is missing. <laughs> Maybe that one was a shooting star. <laughs> and let's try another. <gasps> we hit the sun. It's a lunar eclipse. We did it. Mm -hmm. Rob, no. It's too dark. I can't see anything. It's okay, Emma. There's nothing to be afraid of. But I don't like it. <laughs> Where's the on button? Oh, oh, oh. Sorry. What's that noise? It's a star. He seems really upset about something. It's okay, little star. You don't have to be afraid. You're with friends. Oh! Oh, no! Whoa, he's a speedy little guy. Oh, that poor little star. I don't think he likes the dark either. He should be up in the starry sky. But how do we help him? He's too fast to catch. Maybe if we turn off the sun again, he might come back to turn it on. Eclipse the moon again? <laughs> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's okay, Emma. There's nothing to be afraid of. We're right here beside you. Here, you can even be in charge of pressing the button. Mm -hmm. On the count of three, okay? Okay. I'll do it for the little star. One, two, three! Ah! <laughs> oh, it's okay. We just want to help. Good little star. You're with friends. You don't have to be afraid. <laughs> Great job, Emma! I knew you could do it! You were right. The dark isn't so scary when I know my friends are close. But what are we going to do about this little guy? I get it. He's the missing star. But how are we going to get him back up there? I can help with that. Enjoying the lunar eclipse. Uh, are you sure, Emma? Of course. With my friends and our little star watching over me, what's there to be afraid of? That's the spirit, Emma. And I'd say this is another big mission accomplished. Yeah! <laughs> mission control? Hi, Rob. You're back. So, what did you learn on your mission? to see a lunar eclipse, so we went to the robot moon to see one up close. Lunar is another word for moon, and when a lunar eclipse happens, the moon becomes very dark. 
but we didn't realize how much the dark bothered Emma. And it turned out she wasn't the only one afraid of the dark. Having her friends near and turning off the lights on her own gave Emma the courage to deal with her fear. And in turn, we were able to help the little star. Well done. I think it's time to go home. Better buckle up. Five, four, three, 